And welcome back to Business Matters with me, Ed Butler, and my guest from Shanghai, the independent Chinese economist, Andy Shea. Now, we've been um, hearing from Donald Trump in the last half hour. Andy Shea, looking at this from China, I mean, I don't know if there is a Chinese perspective. It must seem very strange. Um, but how does it play uh, on the Chinese media? I think that Trump is a celebrity, and he has really got this part of the world in interest in the U.S. politics, uh, and also uh, I think it's a, uh, it's a obviously amusing and also uh, 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 disconcerting that, that the United States is uh, is worked up about something like that. So uh, I, I think the, uh, to to a large extent, this is a re- like a reality TV. And uh, it's really a uh, Trump show, so uh, I think, I think that it's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's really good More for, serious, for Trump. But yes. Well, now um, we have, as you know, been hearing from the former president Donald Trump, who uh, has been speaking in the last half hour at his residence, Mar-a-Lago, in Florida. This just a few hours after he faced a judge in a New York courtroom. Um, 34 counts he faced relating to charges to do with payments made during the 2016 election. Andy Shea, how do you feel looking at all of this? It's extraordinary theatre, isn't it? Oh, yeah. I think that all besides the theatre, I think we need to also think about the uh, the foundation for the Trump the phenomenon. I predicted a Trump would win in 2015 because that the, uh, the U.S. Uh, ruling class have ignored the interests of its uh, its people, uh, in particular working class people who have really done poorly over the last four decades. Now uh, uh, there's a, a kind of a consensus that this is bad for the general re- election for Trump. I I don't I don't uh, uh, buy that. Uh, uh, Asian vo- voters Asian voters are economically su- successful, so they should not be a vote for Trump. But uh, they've been turning uh, that way because Biden has uh, has made the, the the America unsafe for 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 these people. So I think that this alliance between the Asian voters and blue collar white workers uh, could, could could be a a serious threat to, to, to Joe Biden in, in, in this election. Interesting. Andy Shea, uh, independent economist there in Shanghai with his perspective. There'll be loads more on this, of course. The indictment against Donald Trump coming up on the World Service News. Do stay with the BBC.